I, li I like this woman, you know? I know. I mean, I really like what you're saying about connecting people to, you know, their somatic experiencing. Yeah. I mean, that's yeah. where it starts, and so many times we're so out of touch with that. And so, look, at you have this psychology background that you don't probably know you have. Well, Maybe you do know you have. That's from the doctor. Color. <laughs> but you know, uh, Diane, you know how a lot of people work in uh, yeah, environments where they're in offices and they're stuck in cubicles or they're... They can't control where they're working, or maybe it's just we're busy all the time and everything. And they go back, and again, if they're renting, they think it's the last thing I want to do. We just take a little bit of time. You can be very happy in your environment. Really happy for for very little, very little effort. So, any other s steps that they could take? Okay, know know about the color. Notice your body inside. How you're reacting. Do not invite children, your neighbors, your relatives to, to uh, seriously, people say, well, you know, I to, uh, my Just sister told me I shouldn't put, I shouldn't put any red in this house. Why? Well, she's a, you know, she's, an, she's a designer. She's a graphic designer. She knows what those colors look like. Well, you know what? They probably don't, usually. And kids, they're... Their vision has not even, their brains have not developed like an adult's has to be able to notice the nuances of colors. That's why children's colors, like in daycare, they're very bright. They're super, you know, wild. And as adults, we have those more subtle gradations and shades and everything. So you don't ask your kids, do you like this? And ask your mother and ask your neighbor and the, you know, the gay couple and the, you know, the gay friend who acts like he's the interior designer. Go by your gut start looking at books and stuff. If you have to watch those damn shows on TV with the home improvement, watch them, but they're usually just pushing product. And again, it's about, like you were saying, you know, go back, feel what it, what it feels like to you. What's the somatic experience you're having? What, we usually know. Yeah. How do people get in touch with you? you go to my website, which is thecolereffect.com, and if you want to read more about some of my adventures like this, I do write about some things. I don't name names. I have a uh, blog site out of there, which you can see right from my website, but it's the color effect, coloreffect.blogspot.com. Could you spell out the color effect just for people who might not under, you know, know how you're yeah, spelling? I got you. T is in Tom, H is in her, E is in every, the word the, and then color, Americanized, C-O-L-O-R, and effect, it's E-F-F-E-C-T.com, thecolereffect.com. Mm. Beautiful. We're going to be closing the show, and we're going to be ending with a lovely song called Proud. So I, I would like to ask you, what are you most proud of? Oh, I, I think the work that I've done out in the community in various ways. I used to be on the Gay and Lesbian Speakers Bureau, and having a girl come across the room to me who was in seventh grade with tears in her eyes and just come up, you know, thanking me so much for sharing like some of the earlier questions that we had in this, in this interview. If I could, you know, help to save one life. And when I walk into homes now as the girl painter that sometimes the moms or the dads say, the kids look at me, and I know that they look and still, I know it's 2012, it still has an impact. It still shows that females need to be strong role models. So. I'm most proud of that, that, that. That's something I can do. Wow. Thank you so much for being on our show tonight. There's never enough time. Yeah. <laughs> right? Um, oh, thank any you. last words, Diana? No, uh, I just really appreciate you. Uh, <laughs> exactly. Yeah. So thank you so much, Thank Joey. you for having me. It's been great. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in tonight. Uh, again, congratulations to Dara Dixon for winning those tickets. And we hope that uh, you, too, can be living proof that you can walk with integrity and pride and do something to help the world and, and get your artistic self met as well, just like Joey, our guest. Everybody have a, have a great night tonight. Good night.